Okay, so we're getting ready to do some manure today. Got our two big payloaders. It's got a huge bucket on it, but this works really well for manure. It's a bigger bucket and I call him Greg. Craig, Craig, because obviously I greased it all up. Dave is filling transmission oil. Luke is filling hydraulic oil on that one. And then once the trucks are here, we'll go, go like mad. So getting this old machine back up here is really bringing back uh, some good old memories for me. Yeah, this is actually one of my first jobs ever on the farm was running these manure spreaders. I was probably nine, 10 years old when I first started. Uh, me and my brothers would be, uh, after school, we'd come home and uh, um, run these all day and then go to school in the morning and do it all over again. It was a, it was a good time. Uh, that and rock picking, those two things that I uh, kind of started on the farm here. So yeah, anything with like tractors or equipment, I was just all for, I would always be tagging along my dad doing something. It just always fascinated me and it still does. Honestly, it still does. Machines just absolutely fascinate me and just love love running them and seeing them work and just all that stuff is just i love it so much so i suppose we should do a dry test before we uh fully load it up make sure everything's going we had two manure spreaders going and it would take us around four weeks to get all the manure spread so to put that in perspective we do most of our manure spreading if we have four trucks coming out doing custom work they get it all done in like one day which is huge for us it's just makes our life so much easier but back in the day we used to load with this old payloader and it would take four bucket loads to fill this machine here and then we had two guys going me and my brothers whatever but now we went to that thing which would one bucket load would probably fill this thing to heaping so yeah we've definitely come a long way so the idea here is to uh, not break the manure spreader. Because I think this is like six ton that I've got on board. And you best believe if I just uh, slam that down on it, we definitely break something. <laughs> I'm just as wide as the machine. Oh dear. What do I do? Hmm. Do I want to do this? Slowly. <laughs> You've already almost filled it. That's full enough. That's full enough for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you. 